Are you trying to affect me? <coughs> what the front door? Oh my gosh! Oh! Oh! Whoa! Yo! Dang. So I got this little handy dandy. Oh my gosh! My name is Zach. I've been to some of the most haunted places in America. I've had doors open in front of me. I've had doors slam when no one else is around. I've even walked the halls of Trans Allegheny, the most haunted destination in America. I've even jumped in the portal of hell at Bobby Mackey's. Come with me as I take you on my haunted travels, most of the time alone. What was that? Oh my god! This is Ghostly Travels with Zach. Tonight, guys, we are at one of the most haunted places in Indiana, and it's so unique. It is not only one of the most haunted places in Indiana, but it is an entire village. Not going to be doing this village 100% alone. There's nobody else here but me. So as I've stated, I am 100% alone here in this village. You guys ready to come and see what we find tonight? Um, I can take you around a little bit. What do you think? You guys want to go around a little bit? Let's do it real fast. Let me take you around. So, um, it is an entire village. Like, you got everything from a schoolhouse to a church, a governor's house. Um, there's also this other really, really creepy church. To me, it's creepy. Now, it's the one back here in the dark, darkness. <laughs> I don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> the most creepy church is in the back. So, there's memorials all over the place. You know, for people. There's the schoolhouse. But, um, this one right here is a bank. This was their bank. Yeah. This place had its own bank. But this is the place that I find extremely fascinating. This is the one I'm drawn to. And even just looking at it, I'm, I'm terrified. This is the, the church. Um, people have gotten some things here, some things not here, but um, this, I heard that already. What? It's a Catholic church. Hello? That spooked the crap out of me. Hi. Oh, it is so echoey. Did I just hear hi? Did you all hear that? It sound like it repeated it back to me. Dude, I'm not even started yet. Can you knock on something? All right, we are now coming up on the schoolhouse. Um, just kind of giving you a rundown. This place is creepy looking. I don't care what nobody says. This place is creepy. Oh, they got mosquitoes already. 
Um, I've heard this one can be active. Hi. So, look at all the old books and everything. It's pretty cool. I mean, just to see how they did stuff back then. Uh, here's all the teams that have been here. It just goes on and on and on. So, I like the schoolhouse personally. I don't know why. I just think it's really, it's got that antique feel. It's not creepy or nothing. So there's roughly 38 buildings here in Billy Creek. Uh, they, some of them date back really, really old, but the village didn't really start to take place in 1964, 1965. Then it opened its doors officially in 1969 to the public. 2012, this place did separate from the Billy Creek Village Inn, or the Billy Creek Inn. Um, this was purchased and restored very well to what it is now by Mr. Greg Larson, who also owns Indiana State Sanatorium. Now you've seen me there, and you've seen me run out of there. So we'll see what happens tonight. I'm very excited. Um, I don't know what to expect either. Coming up on the Baptist Church. Now I don't, I don't know if anybody's really caught anything too much. I think it's the other church. It might be this one. Hello, my name's Zach. I'll be talking with you tonight if you'd like. You don't have to. Can you let me know you're here? What the hell was that? Did you hear that? All right. Man, it's not even cold out. It feels so good out here right now. We are now coming up on the governor's quarter. Now, this is the one that's supposedly like crazy haunted. Um, here it is. I don't know the reasoning by, behind it, but this is the governor's quarters. Governor's house. Um... Relocated to Billy Creek. Items from the 1800s. So some of this stuff is from the 1800s. What the? F the hell was that? I hope that's a cat. Hello? My name's Zach. I don't mean any harm or disrespect. This house is kind of big, kind of. I swear I'm hearing stuff. I'm gonna come back and try to talk to you tonight, okay? I hope that's okay. I keep hearing stuff. I already got a creepy feeling in this house. Yikes. All right, we're in the Baptist church. I don't, I don't know if I remember hearing anything about here. Well, we can always find out, right? I've set out a few pieces of equipment. My name is Zach. And you know harm or disrespect. K2 meter. Rim pod. Um, I just like to say that I am a bench. Are you on a bench? Can you make a loud noise of which bench you're on? Oh my! Oh my gosh! Yo! As soon as I asked. Are you kidding? Thank you. Are you just watching me? 
Kind of weird. Do you want to talk to me? No freaking way! Yes! Yes! You can speak through this, yes! Hi. What is your name? Or do you want to tell me your name? So I got this little handy dandy. Oh my! Oh my gosh! Dude! There was a huge old bump, cap, whatever back there. If that's a cat, I swear. Where are you at, cat? By the way, those doors don't lead to anywhere. It's all storage. Yo, I really hope that was that cat. Can you make a loud audible noise again for me? Please? Oh my, oh. Oh my gosh, that is a loud noise. Thank you. Yo, this is freaking nuts. Thank you, okay. I'm gonna set this down, okay? It's just a voice recorder. It just picks up your voice, okay? No big deal. I just wanna talk, okay? My name is Zach. I mean, you no harm or disrespect uh, to whoever you are. Um, I'd like, can you shut a door maybe? Do you have enough power to shut a door? Ooh, we're here, cat just walked back in. If we're here, go ahead and hit that red dot. Go hit that red dot right there on the bench. Prove to me you're here, please. The cat just jumped up there and it didn't make a noise. So what was that loud thud? I'm still skeptical on that. All right, let's listen to the rest of this, sorry. fuck was that? Oh. Oh. Dude, I'm on edge after that thud. Now coming up on the governor's quarter. Now this is the one that's supposedly like crazy haunted. All right, we're gonna go ahead and uh, be in the governor's room, in the governor's house. Um, I turned on Spirit Talker, and the first thing that comes out is bad things happened. Um, I don't know if that's true or not. Sorry about that. But we're going to go ahead and turn on the voice recorder and see if we can get anything going. I do have a REM pod out. There's a REM pod over Contact. As I talked about the voice recorder. What? All right, here we go. This is just for you and I, okay? Again, I mean no harm, no disrespect. And again, my name is Zach, all right? Can you tell me who lives here? Can you tell me if you want me out? Is that a yes? Are you upset people keep coming in and out of here? Disturbing you? Okay, I find that a little scary. I know a little scary. So I just want to confirm one last time because it's you're making a lot of sense here. 
you want me out, right? If you do, just go ahead and hit that red dot and I'll get out of here, okay? I'll respect your privacy, I'll respect your boundaries, and I will get out. All you have to do is hit that red dot and I will leave. Or you can make a loud audible noise that I can hear. Can you do that? Just like this? How about we do this on the count of three, if you want me to stay and talk to you, hit that red dot. Okay, on the count of three, ready? One, two, three. Huh. Can you say one more word in that spirit talker right there? You don't know what that means, but... Oh! I'm agitated. Oh! Yo! Okay. All right. I will get out of your hair. I apologize. I didn't mean to upset you. That's my bad, okay? Yo, that was wicked in that room right over there. That was like on point responses from the rim pod and from the spirit talker. And a lot of people have a, you know, a skepticism on a spirit talker. It's hard to argue with what we just got, right? At least in my opinion. All right, I've set some equipment out here in the schoolhouse. Um, we have the K2 meter, a cat ball in front of me, spear talker, and come on, man. No, we're not gonna do that, okay? We're not doing that, all right? I don't believe it. We're not going to do that here, okay? And if it is, if there is an actual demon here, I want you to touch one of these desks, one of the pieces of equipment, make a loud noise, something of that, throw a book off the shelf. If you throw a book off the shelf, I'm done. Because I don't believe it, okay? And that's okay if you're just trying to scare me out. So, what I'm going to do is turn on this voice recorder. It's going to be for you and I to communicate. Class is in session. Do we understand? Do we understand? Is anybody here with me? If so, can you make a loud audible noise, please? This cat is going to give me a gosh blessed heart attack. Is there any? Excuse me? Is this a teacher telling me that? If this is a teacher telling me that, can you do this? Everyone get to do the K2. Yo, no way. No way. What? Did somebody just pull up? Oh. Dude, the K2 though. <clears throat> oh, I just feel like something I can't breathe. What? Are you trying to affect me? Light up that meter if you are, the green one right there. <coughs> what the front door? Okay, I felt a very turn of the shift type of thing. And I don't know why that was. Um, after it said shush, and then I inhale, but I don't know, I was like a whiff of like a cloud of something. I don't know. Let's see what this recorder picked up though.
Cat, are you in here? Dude, is there is a cat in here? I'm here walking. The cat's got to be in here. I'm sorry. Why are you sorry? I was just hearing footsteps. Dude, no way. I was quite literally just hearing footsteps walking around. There they are. Ginger. I got really bad cold chill. I don't feel like I should be in here anymore. I don't like it. I don't like this at all. Cat, are you in here? Where is the cat at? Dude, I'm hearing walking. All right, we got the Jesus behind <clears throat> behind us here in the second church or first church, whatever you want to call it. I'm at peace. That's awesome. Oh, I forgot it's back here. I do have a few devices out. Um, we'll see. We'll see. If you'd like to come speak with me tonight, my name is Zach. I mean you no harm. I mean no disrespect. I am religious myself. I have the power of children. What do you mean children? Is there children in this church? If there is, can you light one of my pieces of devices? My one of my pieces one of my pieces of equipment up? Please? Just let me know. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Hello, children. Can you do me one favor so we can kind of figure this out? How many children are here? Is it one? They said, right. There's only one child here? What? If there is one child here, can you light something up or make a noise? Can I get a knock or two? If you want to talk? It is really, really quiet. It's, it's pretty quiet overall in here. Now a lot of people talk about the churches and one of them is really bad. And I'm thinking it's the other one because... No, I can't. Okay, you don't have to. Um, because this one is just silent. This one is very silent. Hello? Did you leave? Oh, 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 oh. <coughs> oh my gosh. The K2 just had a huge spike. I'm a nobody. <laughs> Can you knock on which uh, bench you're sitting in? You've got to be careful. Okay, okay. Do I got to be careful in here? Is there something in here I should be worried about? If so, can you light something up again, please?
we are going to enter the doctor's office. Um, this place is creepy too. Hello? Um, I'm a little nervous to be in this one by myself. <laughs> so this is Dr. Rice's office. Um, this was remodeled in 1865. So, yeah, this building dates back to 1800s. Hello, Dr. Rice. Hello, sir. Um, I think you were a dentist, if I am correct. I actually just had a tooth pulled. Yeah, I actually just had a tooth pulled. Yeah, you were a dentist, that's right, I remember now. It kinda hurt. I don't know how you guys do it now. Or then, I'm sorry, I don't know how you do it then, but at least now they, they numb you up a little bit, right? So, put some more history on it. So as I'm setting up, getting the equipment out for you guys, the first thing that comes out of Spear Talker, he'll get you. He'll get you. I can't, I, I'm done. I can't do this. Just kidding. Um, we are in the doctor's office. If you can, can you tell me what type of office we are in? If you are able to. Yikes. Is your name Patricia? So that went off at the same time. That went off. I have a few devices around if you would like to communicate with me, okay? It's just you and I, nobody else. My name is Zach. And I come with you. Oh. Patricia, are you scared in here? Are you scared of the dentist? If so, can you make a noise or light one of my pieces of equipment up? If Mr. Rice is here, Dr. Rice, can you light something up or say hello? Dr. Rice, can you tell me why you became a dentist? Yo. Dude, so right before it said powerful, I thought I heard like a bang on the wall. That, that's the bridge. That bridge is getting me every time. Mr. Rice, are you still in the building at all? I want to try this. It's called a voice box. What it does is it scans through radio frequencies and you can manipulate them to talk to me. What do you say? Here we go. Dude, I just seen something run past there. Here we go. S box. Scanning. FM. Dr. Rice, are you here? Is anybody here? Hello?
Can you tell me what type of office we are in? Now in the general store, uh, in the back of it, because the front of it's kind of loud. Uh, but as I'm setting up, taking like a half a second break, I'm quite literally hearing footsteps up here. Now you cannot get access to this. The store room. So I assume... <laughs> we are right next to a main road. So as soon as I turn it on again, attack hunter. So is it saying attack me, the ghost hunter? I don't know. Well, here we go. Is there anybody out here that wants to communicate with me tonight? There's a music box, rim pod, um, K2 meter. You can come talk to me. It's just you and I. Ooh. What the fuck? Yo. What the hell is that? Hello? Dude, there's nobody freaking up there. I just thought I seen a face. No freaking way, dude. Absolutely. Oh my gosh. Yo. I'm freaking out. I don't like this no more. What? Oh, I got chills all over my body. Yikes. You can come talk to me. You don't have to be afraid. Can you do me one favor? Can you tell me the name on this door? If you can see me and hear my voice, can you tell me the name on this door, please? What is the name on that door right behind me? Wow, <laughs> wow, we had some amazing responses tonight. The governor's house, the school, uh, the footsteps in the general store, the church with the big old bang, and then the other church, two ginormous K2 spikes. I have chills just talking about it. We had an incredible night here at Billy Creek. I can't thank uh, them enough letting me come here tonight I, we just had so much stuff happen in such a cool little place especially during the day you should definitely come during the day but I mean what are your thoughts what do you think you know what with that being said make sure we like subscribe keep the comments rolling and with that <laughs> I will see you in the next adventure bye guys